All right, guys. Here's my uh, Taro 680 Pro. Um, it's my first real raw build. Uh, working it up. Uh, so I've been testing a lot of things. Uh, but what I'm going to show you guys today is the two different batteries I've been working with. Uh, I've been working with the. This is my standard 4,000 milliamp 40 C discharge battery. Got it from Hobby King. And this is my new 5200 milliamp 10C discharge battery, also from Hobby King. And the things you'll notice right away are the size. They're about the same weight, about the same size. You can see about size-wise, they're about all the same. And I have two of each, so I run them in, in uh, tandem. And... I just want to do some little simple testing to show flight time with uh, about the same weight uh, weight uh, that they would have with both batteries. So uh, we'll see what we get here. I'm running the Taro 680 Pro, like I said. I do have a camera gimbal. I'm running multi-star motors here. They are the 570 kilovolt motors. And I'm running 13 by 44 carbon fiber props from Foxtech. And I'm running Arducopter uh, board, flight board on this on this uh, cool little copter. So also I'm running Afro 30 amp speed controllers underneath. It's not the cleanest build in the world, but we'll give it a go. So let's see what happens. Okay, flight one is done, and let's see what the, these are the four, two 4,000 milliamp batteries, let's see what they come up to here. So they finished at, see each, each cell is at 3.62 and that was on the auto land, 3.63, 66, 61. So we'll do a little balancing there. 14.5 overall, so that's not too bad. So let's see what we got going on with the other set of batteries. The batteries are a little bit warm to the touch, but really not bad at all. And the speed controllers, just slightly warm to the touch, not too, not bad at all. So we'll swap everything out, get ready for the next flight, and we'll see what they do and how long they go. I'll give you the comparison at the end. All right, switched everything out, and we are now ready to go test our 10C our 10C 5200 milliamp batteries, two of them, so we should have uh, 1,400 milliamp hours. So we'll see what our time does there. Okay, we finished our flight with our uh, low C discharge batteries. Let's see what we got here. Looking at around 14.8 when we landed. 3.68. Pretty close. Alright, so let's go take a look at what our overall results are. Okay, so we got our two batteries here again. And I'm going to pop up the screen that shows the comparison between these two batteries. It shows their weight uh, you can see they're very, very close. Um, there, it'll show. It shows the big thing I notice is the price. The price is within two dollars. Uh, the size, the dimensions, both in thickness, length, width, everything, they're very, very similar uh, in weight. And the flight comparisons are virtually identical. Uh, I did get an extra two minutes out of my setup right there, and I think with some fine-tuning with props, and once I kind of get all my wires tied up and everything kind of geared up correctly, I think uh, in the end we'll probably have a, we'll probably get several extra minutes of flight time for just a couple dollars, and I think it's probably well worth it. So in my opinion, this is a good, this is a great battery to use. Um, the low the low discharge rate the batteries get a little bit warm but you know not not bad 
and the flights I've had with them so far have been very good, uh, and they've and they've worked out quite well. So um, I have the links for both the batteries in the uh, description below. So check them out. Decide you know what's going to work for you. Uh, these batteries are designed specifically for multi-copter use and um, not for say a helicopter or a plane or something like that where it needs higher discharge rate. These are specifically for the multi-copters and um, so give it a go. I, I like them. I think so far they've been very good and I'm looking forward to see how they work out in the long run. Alright, hope you guys liked the video. Um, send me any comments you need below and appreciate you watching. Have a great one.